Welcome back. This is the first person view of Mario. First person view? Yeah, see? I can look around. I don't know if I ever told you I can, like, get first person view. That's not first person. Well... You're still third person. Shut up! You're just close to him. <laughs> shut up! <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I don't want to spread misinformation or anything. That's not misinformation. It's the... It's the look at this. Like, yeah. Oh, oh, no, look no, at I that. I can tell that this is, like, a... I, I don't, know where I don't know to go. Call you can call it the looky mode, or uh, looky mode. Looky. That sounds lame. We're still using ham tower terms. Oh my god, we are. <laughs> but no, I just mean, I just mean in the sense that you can aim where you're looking. Yes. Uh, if you can think of a better term for it than looky mode, go for it. I'm I'm down for it. I don't know. I don't want to rip on ham taro. Well, yeah, that's fine too. But oh, you know what? I think I can guess something right now. No, you can't. Not what I wanted to do. <laughs> oh, I think it? I saw it up there. Where is it? Where are you, little star? There you are. Okay, you're up there somewhere. I know that. And hoop, 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 hoop. Damn it. Hoop, hoop, hoop. There we go. Hey. Look at that, a free star. Free star! Freestyle. Do a freestyle rap right now. Oh, don't forget your free star. Do a freestyle rap right now. Free, free, free star, free, free, free star. No, I don't know how to rap. Okay. <laughs> don't ask me to rap. All right, I'm making it, uh, I'm making it two now. Yep. I should have saved that for one of the episodes when I'm like, I'm doing like, really whoa! What happened? You just jumped up on the rail, that's all. <laughs> Thump. No big. I should have saved that for an episode where I'm doing, like, really bad. Uh, you did, except you accidentally, instead of grabbing it, fell into the portal. <laughs> that was the last star that I was supposed to get. But, um... You know. It's fine. All you gotta do is, uh... Just... Yeehaw! Fuck. Wow. I was gonna say, all you have to do is get back to rocking it, and as I was saying that, you fell into a pit. <laughs> Not my fault. Well... They should not have been blazing at that point. <laughs> well, I mean, that's debatable. I mean, if they have the steady job, they shouldn't be blazing at all. <laughs> that's true. If you have a job, you have no excuse to be blazing it. Well, I, I, I don't know about that. Mario! Mario! Come on! Is that a death pit? Yes. Nice. That's okay, I survived it, though. Yeah, you did not fall into the death pit. I, mean, I guess if, if your job is to blaze it, I mean, what kind of job is that though? Nobody should have a job where they're specifically required to blaze it. That's the thing is though that like um you know you hear a lot of people are like high at work. Yeah. We're talking about weed, by the way. Yeah, our our state has it legal now. Oh, uh, I think a lot of states do. No, actually not. Oh, we're out. No, like we're like one of the ones that does. And I, I I feel like though that I have heard that it's it has raked in a lot of revenue. Like, the, the business as a whole. So... Oh, dude, it's, like, getting, like, millions of dollars. If not billions. So, for economic reasons, uh... Yeah. Hooray. Yeah. But, um... Yeah, you know, I just... I wish people were smarter with when and where they use it. I realize that a lot of people do not like their jobs. And, uh... Okay, can, can I, I'm... I'm curious. Uh-huh. I'm gonna say it. Okay. I'm curious. But it's not worth losing my job over. No. Like, say if like, yeah, I, I get I get fired or laid off for like uh -huh. a month or so, I might try it. I mean, it's all legal around here. Yeah, and um, it's not known to be that harmful. I would say don't do it, but that's because I'm a hardcore kind of person who says that things like uh, I mean, I'm the same with like cigarettes and alcohol. Really, it's like, I would not spend money. You should take another drink. I would not spend my money. To essentially poison myself. You should take another drink. I do not think it's a worthwhile expense. Take your drink. Fine, I'll take a swig. And this isn't <laughs> this is not alcohol that I bought, by the way. I did not spend money on this. Take a drink. Uh I think I've only ever bought alcohol once in my life. I bought some ale at like a uh, Ren Fair. Only because it was ale. Because it was ale, and I was like, oh cool, it's like one of those medieval generic drinks that they always have in taverns. I wanna try that. And it was pretty awful. Didn't care for it. Nah, Probably it, won't happen yeah, again. It's, it's basically beer. It's basically beer. Um, so I didn't care for it, and that was the only time. That's the only time in my life I've bought my own alcohol. 
Yeah, all the other times I've like, I'm the one that's like, dude, you should try this. Yeah, no, you've you've given me some stuff, and like some of it's been pretty good. Uh, taste wise, like the absinthe was pretty great, surprisingly. Absinthe is great. Um, uh, but yeah, so I just mean like, uh, I personally don't like the idea of spending my money to essentially kill myself. Like that just seems idiotic from my perspective. Well. So it's the same thing with, um, you know, uh, drugs like weed. Like, I would never do it because I would rather have my senses about me. It's not like it's gonna make your life suck less. You might forget about it for a little while, but that doesn't really solve the problem. In fact, now you've just added another problem to the pile. Yeah. Uh, if you want to try it, like, recreationally, like, once in a while, you know, it's just your life, you do what you want. Um, oh, I think I stay but... I mean, you know, I just feel bad when I hear about these people who spend, like, you know, they buy, like, two packs of smokes a week. And it's like, that is a lot of money that you're dropping into literally just making yourself smell awful and hurt your lungs. And, like, with no benefits. <laughs> I can't remember where the rest of them are. They're probably around here somewhere. I think they're up top. But, yeah, I'm, like, I, I, I'm, I'm curious. I mean, I want to know what the big thing is, because, I mean, it's something like... Practically yeah. every movie ever. <laughs> well, well, alcohol is in like practically alcohol, every movie ever. and, and like and like if it's not, there's weed. There is there is a fair amount of weed in movies these days. I wouldn't say it's in like hardly any movies though. It's in a lot. It's in quite a few. Um, but like I'm okay. I'm I am I'm I'm not gonna lie. I'm curious. Sure. Um, but yeah, there's I'm not. Wrong I'm with curiosity. I'm not gonna like go out and get one because my uh, my job does like random drug tests. Oh yeah, I mean especially for your job like. Like, again, we started this by talking about, like, on-the-job smoking. Yeah. No, if you're doing construction, like, that is serious. Yeah. You you should not like, be drinking like the, or smoking. No, we are, like, the number three like most dangerous job, like, ever. Yeah. Compared to, to uh, logging and commercial fishing. Yeah. So, um, no, there's really no excuse. Like, if someone at a grocery store has at least some leeway to argue that, like, Maybe they can get away with it without being like a danger to themselves and others. If they don't have another job and they're just like a house person or something. Yeah, but you know, even then, there's still like a certain amount of like professionalism. Like if you get if a reputation, kids. if you get a reputation as that guy who went to the back room and started smoking weed, like that is going to reflect badly God, on I you. I think for somebody years. we knew like had a job at a grocery store, mm -hmm. and oh crap, I didn't even look at it. It's okay. I know where to go. Cool. Um, yeah, and uh, somebody we we knew worked at a grocery store, mm -hmm. and like four people got fired because they would like sneak into the back stock room and like smoke pot. You need to stop doing that. Shut up. <laughs> it, I'm not smoking pot. No, I mean jumping right into the fire without waiting. <laughs> I know you're not smoking pot. They'd sneak into the back room and like smoke pot like during work hours. Yes, that is a problem. And um, yeah, he came. They, he Remember he, he he came up over to us. He's like, "Yeah, they got they got caught like in the back room, like smoking weed, like on top of the fruit that they were like supposed to stockpile in the in the grocery store." Yeah, well, I just mean smoking on the job in general would be bad. No, that's stupid. Yeah, I mean, like, I like I like the drink. Sure. I fuck no, I'm gonna drink on job. <laughs> that's just that's idiotic. Just stupid. Yeah, like. There is, is no sensible reason to do that. I like the, the sauce. On the bright side, I I'm think it's gonna... generally, like, really young people. Like, the people who are in high school or just leaving high school that are dumb enough to do that. Oh, um, there should be one right here, actually. And I, I'd i like to assume that they learn pretty quickly that that kind of behavior is not, like, okay. But I think most of the time it's just because they don't care about their jobs, right? Yeah. Like, if you were doing a job you liked, you probably wouldn't uh, do something that you knew was going to risk it. I feel like I got the hiccups. Well, then get rid of them. Scare me. Boo! Not working. <laughs> it's worth a shot. That was the wrong way. This area is a bit of a maze. I guess that's why they have the, um... Actually, I think this thing was called the Misty Maze, wasn't it? Yeah. Something like that, this area. And, uh, that's probably why there was a map at the entrance. Fuck the map. Well, I mean, you say that because... No, you, fuck the map. You've played this game a lot. I'd probably use the map. So what do I know? 
Absolutely nothing. Here it is. Maps! Whoa! Were they good for absolutely nothing? That'd be a much stranger song. <laughs> like... I mean, the, the message of that song is, like, anti-war. Yeah. And that's that's well and good. Like, war kind of sucks. Sometimes it's necessary. Well, I mean, there are times, of course, when... I mean, like, imagine if, like, World War II, like... You know, Germany is being all dickish. And yes. Like, and they're like... White supremacy. Yeah, and, and like... And then no, genocide. Like, and every single country is like... Mm, nah. No, we don't we don't want to do war. War's name. Yeah, like no, I'm not saying that there is no purpose for war. This isn't the one I'm supposed to get, but I'm going for it. Cool. You do you, man. But um Yeah. It'd be yeah. weird if there was a song that was, that was freaking Maps are worthless, so screw maps. Well, actually they kind of are cuz I mean everything's all GPS nowadays. It's true. Also, have you ever looked at like a real world map? Absolutely. They I are confusing. Will, I will never lose my ability to read a real, real world map. I know how to. Okay, that's good. Yeah. I mean, when the zombie apocalypse happens, GPS is going down the shitter. That's true. Um, and, you know, I'm not saying that, you know, real maps aren't a bad thing. I, think I just I mean, like, every time I've looked now. at one, I'm like, God, freaking... There's like a bajillion things on here. And it's usually hard enough to find where you are. And then you have to try and figure out which direction you're facing. It's just... ugh. I can't imagine them being helpful. Oh, I know where to go. They are not easy to use. Sorry, Mario. You're not sorry. Not at all. You make him run to... Oh, God. <laughs> nah, we're good. You make him run to rocks and walls all the time. We're good. Taking a lot of hits, though. You sure you're gonna make it? Absolutely. Blum, 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 blum. Do you think you can make it next time on Operation Pixel? No, I can't. <laughs> well, I'm good. 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 It's gonna be next time. No, it's not. You're that close. Fly down the hill. You're that close. No. Because it's about time to end this episode. Oh, geez, don't do that to me. I can end this episode right now. Why? Because it's about that time. <sighs> no. What? End it. End it. End it. End it. Ark's committing suicide, everybody. Uh, I'll see you next time. Look at, look at Mario committing suicide. As I do a solo podcast. Where's his mustache? Oh, that's weird. <laughs>